Hi YouTube. So this obviously is going to be an unboxing with me. Yes, I got the Jeffree Star Mystery Box for Valentine's Day. Bear with me, I'm tired. I worked a double shift today, two different jobs, so I'm super tired. So don't mind my appearance. And I'm not thinking correctly, but I was too excited to wait to open up this box. So um, I thought I'd share with all of you what is going to be inside it. Since it just came, I think it's February 3rd or 4th. What what's Thursday? So I'm so excited it came. I kind of want to wait till Valentine's Day, but I can't. So stick with me. Welcome to my channel. I hope you enjoy it. I already can see I need a darker lip. It looks like I'm dead, but whatever. She's been working. Anyways, so. Just stay and watch and be entertained by seeing what Miss Jeffrey has in store for Valentine's Day. This is my first mystery box and when I saw him reveal the mystery box, I had to have one of these because of the things that it included. Even though it was like $180, I had to have it. So I'm excited. Let's get into it. So as you can see, it comes in this box. This is the Supreme, I think, the most expensive one, which I love this box, obviously. It's like a take on um, Conversation Hearts, and I'm obsessed with that look, and I love pink and red, so it's obviously red, baby pink, and like a more like fuchsia hot pink. Let's see what's inside. I'm excited, but you couldn't, maybe you can't even tell because I'm so tired. I might keep this box actually because it's so cute. Clearly, he had these ready to go because I swear it just became, it was just on sale. I was freaking out. I thought I wouldn't get one. But by the grace of heaven, I did. All right, let's see. He said there's gonna be a new mirror, so I hope to add a new mirror. I don't have that many, but I do love the ones that I have so far. All right, I scratched up the box. All right, when you open the box, of course, she is packed to the nine, teeny. She looks like this with matching tissue paper. Jeffree Star, obviously his, his pattern, JJ, in the star with the baby, three colors, white, baby pink, and magenta. Wow, she's unexpected, sis. Well, that's cool. She is, she's going to be very wearable. <laughs> I never ordered one of these, so it's kind of exciting. So this is what she looks like. You can see what I was talking about, that, um, the nudes, it's the nude collection. The little mini nudes, so that's super wearable, so that's probably a good idea. And it looks like a shirt. Yes, I'm big and I want a big shirt, okay? And then that card on top is, he keeps giving little secrets of like his, his, um, his skin line coming, which I'm super excited about because you know he's obsessed with Skincare. It says it's coming up February 25th, 22. That's coming up. So you see the shadows of the bottles. The last thing I got during Christmas time, it was like one little thing. He's been hinting at it. All right, let's get in. So 
So we start with the Jeffree Star Cosmetics. Open here for nudes. That's cute. Clearly, lots, probably lots of people have this. I never, it just, she's kind of expensive, and I have so many of the liquid lips in full size, I never got the minis. So. Ta da! That's pretty cool. So it comes with Skin Tight Mannequin Celebrity Skin Posh Spice Rose Matter Gemini Leo and Androgyny. They're super cute. It's nice. They're probably really great to like travel with and have in your purse. So. Love it. I mean, I love. I love his liquid lipsticks, and that's probably a great one to have because you get to wear it a lot. Even though I don't mind a weird color, I do not. So we have. His Supreme Gloss in Improper. What color is that? Like, I'm not sure. The value of this, he said it was like $300 or something. So, living. <laughs> oh, honestly, I think I have one already. Improper. Is that what I put? Don't mind that. <laughs> she fell. The table fell. Everything's fine. Damn. I do have it. Because I got it in one of... Uh, he was like giving away a free lip gloss with a, a, pro, a purchase. So I end up getting that one. It's a really pretty color. So... Hmm. Maybe I'll do what other YouTubers do and get a giveaway. <laughs> Please subscribe. Give mama some followers. I knew she's new, but brand new. Kind of bummed a tiny bit for that one because she already have it, honey. That's okay. It's a really pretty color, so why not? All right, and then of course we have boom. This is one thing that really sold me the LED star selfie light. When he introduced that on his channel, I was like, yes, girl. She said she can't, you know, she's not going to have them in his store. There she is. Love it. Here's the other side. Selfie mirror. Too cute. I never had one comes with instructions and the cord and the bubble wrap so that's exciting she never had a selfie um light so that's perfect jeffree star is definitely my aesthetic girl everything is pink star as you know in my name is i miss my stage name ashley glam star and i put two r's because that's what my my drag mother Day. Hey. A little filler. Ooh, fun. I just I just revealed some um boom some um individual shades, which is fun because I just haven't got any yet. So I wonder if it will come with the case to hold them. Hmm, if not, I'll have to get one, but that's cool. We have Freak Show. Let's see, um, we'll have to work on this lighting and the angle. She's so shiny. Freak Show. It says it's a pressed pigment. I don't know. I can't tell if it's like a black or if it's like a brownish gray. I'm not sure. We have Divine Intervention. She actually looks really pretty. It's like a. <coughs> excuse me. Like a green, shimmery color. We have Private Island. It's so hard to see. You can't even see because the glare. Sorry. You know how she likes shiny packaging. Private Island is kind of like a camel brown. 1985. That's probably when she was born. Hi, 1981. Spoiler alert, she's old. She looks like a matte gray. And then open range is like a um, metallic brown. 
Well, these are all very wearable colors, even though I don't mind. I would wear, I wear crazy colors. As you can see, I have pink and purple ombre eyebrows right now. So, <laughs> I'm not afraid of color, honey, at all. Hello. Okay, now I see right on top is that shirt. So, it's a shirt. All cute. I can see the pink. So, let's open that up. Open that up. She's black, which I love. That's perfect. Oh, cute. See, another reason I got the um the Valentine's collection is because I'm obsessed with like the palette of like pink and um red and like hearts and love and that kind of thing. Like I love that look. So this is perfect for me. So you can see in the front, it's like a Jeffree Star with a broken heart, and then on the back. You can see it says heartbreaker. So cute. So cute. And this and it's like in a like a light pink with like an orangey flare and then like the um it's like a corally peach, you know, the darker one. It looks more pink on, on the, the video, but in person it's more like a, a corally pink, but I love that. I love that. Okay, there's other things that are wrapped in like um like tissue paper, so I'm going to save those. I'm going to go for ones that I already can see. Boom, the gloss. So this is the gloss that looks like Shane's Shane's possibly the green one, which I don't have. Oh, this is called Peach Price Tag. Let's see what that is. Oh, I'm about to ruin the box. I hate that. I'm a pack rat. I saved the boxes even though I shouldn't. <laughs> Ooh. Pretty. Wow. Maybe I'm not up to date or is this brand new? This green one with that beautiful green top. It's like a watermelon colors. It's called Peach Price Tag. It's like a peach color with a shimmery green, like, flex inside. I love that. I love the packaging and the color. It's probably gorgeous. I love that. Does it smell like peaches? Mm -hmm. No, it's that, like, birthday cake, cupcake, vanilla. Put a little on. <laughs> Not that you can tell. Well, that's pretty. I don't know if I'm, like, clueless or if I just miss the fact that, um, she had it. I don't remember seeing that introduced. I don't know. Maybe I'm behind. Okay, in this pink box, it's let me be perfectly clear. She sounds like she might be a clear gloss. We'll see. I have a few. I have the Shane Dawson, like, Ruby or clear one, the gloss, and what else? I have the black one and then the um, pink shimmery one and like an iridescent one. Oh yeah, nice. That's his version, just clear. But this cap has the um, the pink clear and the gold. Where Shane's was this clear one, the Ruby one with the silver. That's cool. You can never get too many um, clear glosses, right? You really can't. It will never go out. Ooh, I love, I love these lip scrubs. Can you see behind me? Down there, boom, boom, boom. There's like five, like six or seven. I love those. So here we have, this is so cute. It is um, rainbow sherb, sherb, sorbet, sherbet, rainbow sherbet, whatever you want to say it. My people told me she was rainbow sherbet. He, you know how he always says he has a sweet tooth, so that's cute. That seems brand new. Or maybe I'm just clueless. For Laura Lip Scrub, rainbow sorbet, a rainbow sherbet. 
too cute. Let's give us some. Pretty. They did that lime color. It's pretty. Love that. Summery, springy, fresh. It's fun. I love that. I wonder if that's new too. I don't know. Maybe I'm out of the loop. It's very possible. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll show you what it's looking like. Boom. So I can see, I can see the reveal. I can see it looks like the orangey palette, which is pretty awesome. That was iconic palette. She really loves color, AKA me. So that's not a palette that I would normally gravitate to. I love his crazy ones, his crazy colors. I'm just, honestly, it's such an iconic, like the photo shoot, the concept, the name, like it's obviously just pushing, pushing the boundary. And I love it. I love it. I have it. Because, I mean, hello, a neutral. Can't go wrong. You can't go wrong. Oh, amazing. On the orgy, it's just like a bunch of beautiful naked bodies. Love that. So you've, you've all seen it. I won't waste your time and bore you. I'm sure this video is way too long. So, I'm excited for that. Okay. We have this. I love this. I'm going to save this. Because she's wrapped up. I'm going to keep going with things that I can see. Magic Star Yellow Concealer. That's so funny because literally... Don't hate me, Jeffrey, but I was at Nordstrom's Rack because... I wanted to buy that cheap makeup because I love you and I support you with full price. But sometimes you just want a good deal. I'm not going to show you the whole thing. It's like, I don't want to screw it up and ruin it, but it's that yellow concealer. Oops. I think this star got broken. That was probably my fault. <laughs> That's exactly what I didn't want to do, but there's like a cute star on the top. Or maybe it got ruined in shipping, I don't know. Man, that was the cutest part of that. Oh yeah, she's broken. I'm sort of disappointed about that. That was what I was worried about. Oh yeah, she was broken. I mean, that happens, I can't, it is what it is. But you can see, the star is broken, that's the best part about that. Uh, obviously that's not Jeffrey's fault, just the, yeah, it happens. I've never had anything broken with all this makeup. Nothing's ever been ruined, but. Eh, I'm disappointed. Maybe I can have them replace that for me. I don't know. I heard the customer service is good, but uh, I shouldn't let that bother me. Not let one thing, but this is my favorite packaging. This concealer, that gorgeous top with the star and the like crystal top. That's one of the reasons I love Jeffree Star's makeup so much is because of the packaging. It's gorgeous. All right, only four more, no, five more items, including that special one. I see, like, a, I don't know what else. What is this? A velour, ooh, lip liner. Nice, mannequin, perfect. Because I think in the nude palette, I just got mannequin was one of the colors. That's another thing I love, the lip liners. The packaging is gorgeous. All of this packaging is beyond gorgeous that's like one of my favorite reasons to get his makeup is because honestly there's so much makeup out there 
but his packaging is just my vibe. Like, I'm, I'm obsessed with pink. Clearly, I have pink hair. But, um, I'm having a hard time getting it out. But, yeah, hello. This amazing, cute packaging. It looks like the Space Needle, to be honest, from Seattle. But, you know, mannequin is just like a perfect little nude. That will be perfect to... To line my lips with all those new colors. That's smart. That was smart thinking. I hope they did that on purpose. I think so. Like I've heard that they're trying to be more cautious than um, what is it called? Like um, conscious of like how they put the boxes together. Because before I think at the beginning, if you remember, it was more like obviously it's like things that are like overstocked, too many items, and things that maybe aren't selling so well. But so I think he learned over the years to like, people really enjoy these and to put some exclusive items in there so that people um, get excited. And like, there's like exclusive things that no one else will get. So it's kind of fun. So yeah. Okay, we got a velvet trap. Please tell me I don't have this color. Celebrity skin. Perfect. It's crazy that's like all the nude shades. It's a lot of nudes in here. I wonder if everyone got the same stuff. That makes me really wonder. Like, did everyone get the same? But I love the new the new packaging. The bullet. Like it's just it's heavy, it's magnetized, the star. I love that. The stars that are on that, hello, gorgeous. It's just, it's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So that's like a brownish nude. Hmm, everything I got was in the nude family. Well, at least it's super, super wearable. I'm a little disappointed a little bit because you'd think with like Valentine's, that's kind of why I got it. And then it'd be more like pinks. I was hoping for some of the pink religion. Because at the time I couldn't afford the pink religion. So you think it'd be more like pinks and reds. And like exclusives like that. That's how the Halloween ones I thought. The Halloween Mr. Box was like more themed with those colors. Hey they're very wearable. Can't complain about that. You'll be able to wear them anywhere, anytime. So that's good. I just wish there was more. At least pink, because I love pink, clearly. Okay, I should be excited about this. This is looks like a liquid lip in this red. Red packaging, red metallic with pink. Ooh, that's probably new and exclusive. A color that, see, that's what I live for. Things that won't be made again. This is called Cutthroat Love. It looks like it's gonna be bloody, like the color of blood. <laughs> you know how he loves gruesome. I do too. Ooh, gorgeous. Unless I'm missing something, which clearly I haven't seen everything, but it's this gorgeous um, metallic red with like um an a b crystal glitter for the insignia as you can see it's like a deep a deep blood red creamy um very like um what like wifey what else i'm looking behind me it's very wifey, it's very unicorn blood, that kind of vibe. So, actually that's, that's them together. This is unicorn blood and this is the new one, Cutthroat. The new Cutthroat Love is very unicorn blood. It is, as you can see, it's pretty close. I would say it's a little more it's a little, it's like one shade lighter, like more reddish pinkish, where Unicorn Blood is a little more brown toned, 
They're very similar. I was right. I was right. Is she, is she scented? Let's see. I hate to take it out and mess it up. It's so like perfect, see? It's like perfect white, not been touched. And I don't think it is as most scented. No scent, but pretty. And I love that packaging. Again, exclusive packaging. And though that deep red color is a beautiful color, just like Unicorn Blood is like, nice 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 all right two things left here we have that you know he showed us this mirror i really love the mirrors i think they're so fun and i was hoping for something super fun because i love the mirrors and he said only in this box would you get this mirror so i'm excited to see and what is it she is, boom, heartbreaker, just like the t-shirt. So it's a light pink. Oh, it's pretty much in that unicorn blood, new color, cutthroat love, reddish brown. It's cute. I was hoping, honestly, I think it would have been so cute to have one of these, like the, almost like conversation heart with the... JC insignia on it but we'll see we'll see when I open it up with the handle but he said it was I had a clear thing so you could see through it just like apparently the dog mirrors were like that it's cute it's kind of see it's kind of gothy as you can see love the light pink it's it's simple like I'm surprised like there's the heart the the words heartbreaker are, is raised but there's not like a design or i'm kind of surprised about that tiny bit disappointed but it's okay it's fun it comes with a heartbreaker sticker oh i hate i hate ruining even it's stupid but even the stickers Remember that year he gave stickers away in the mystery boxes? People were not happy. Love you, Jeffrey, but yeah, I honestly, I don't think I would have been happy either. You pay all that money and you like stickers? No, girl, that's not it. All right, she's about to open her. Boom. Oh. Hi, I pray I didn't break it. Ooh, didn't break it. Well, it's just like the that same shape, teardrop shape. There she is. There she is. Ooh, show you my messy room. Not cute. Well, it has the Jeffree Star and it's his Jeffree Star Cosmetics. She is simple, simple, simple Sally. I don't know. I'm a little disappointed. I was hoping more of a pattern. More like like intricate design. I don't know. I'm kind of surprised a little bit. Love Jeffrey. Love love your products, but I'm a little disappointed. It's cute. I love I love the heart shape. I do. But I'm disappointed a little bit. Like I, you know how he's extra with everything, so I'm kind of surprised. Like it's not extra. It's just simple. Yeah, the colors are pretty though. I thought it'd be more, more exciting. Okay, this video is too long. Hopefully, we'll edit it. I don't know. I've never edited it before. <laughs> She's new to the YouTube. But hey, <laughs> hopefully someone will watch this. <coughs> Excuse me. Hopefully I can get it up soon. I almost feel guilty because maybe it's going to ruin the surprise. But I also feel like that's part of the fun is people like to see these videos. Because when I didn't have, when I, this might, like I said, my first mystery box. So I love when people do these unveilings and show them. So here's that last one. Remember I kept it a secret. Because it's all wrapped up. So I couldn't see what it was. 
I have a feeling. Oh, I'm hoping that she's like an exclusive, another exclusive. Like it looks to me, it's almost like a palette. Maybe it's gonna be a highlighter palette. <gasps> Cute. I was right. Isn't that funny? I feel like in his exclusives, I feel like he does. He loves the highlighter, which honestly, I'm not wearing any highlighter. Oh no, I am. I guess just a tiny bit inside. I'm wearing his Nefri, mm -hmm. the purpley one with he made with Nathan. Sorry, baby. Shout out to Nathan. He's so hot. If I'm available and single, just kidding. Sorry, Jeffrey. Okay, ready? Boom. Cute. Heartbreaker in this white with the pink. With those letters that are same with that. It's like, see, it's like broken glass. Cute, cute. See, the mirror should be more like that. See, it just like, it has more to it. Do you see? It gives like, it's, it's hard to see in the screen. But the letters are like raised. And it has, they have this like shimmery shine on it. That gives the look of like, like that they're wet, slick kind of a thing. Cute. And I was right. Skin frost. Highlighter palette. Love that. Love that. Because honestly, his highlighters are amazing. Funny though, the back of this, do you see right here? 2000, it's hard because it's backwards. 2017. 2017? What does that mean? Is this a collection that just never happened? That he wanted to happen? Or maybe that means nothing. Maybe it's not the year. Maybe this is the number of the palette. I don't know. What is 2017? 2017. Oh, cute right here on the side that has a red heart that says Heartbreaker Skin Frost Highlighter Palette. Cute. It's cute. See, I kind of wish the the mirror looked like that. Like, just more <gasps> cute. I saw, like, a sneak pink. She's pink. Yes. See, I feel like the mirror should have looked like this. See, it's, like, the colors. It's, like, vibrant. It's fun. It's in that state, like, wet, dipping in, like, candy. The heartbreaker. Ooh, you couldn't I couldn't see it at first, but in different angles. I don't know if you can tell if we can get the angle. Do you, oh yeah, yeah, a little bit. See how there's like the Jeffree Star like embossed in a wet look on it. Cute. Here's the back. Cute. It's really cute. And again on the back, it says 2017. I wonder if it's gonna be revealed later. If he was supposed to that's a long time ago that he was going to come out with this in 2017 and didn't happen. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, I kind of, I wish that was on the, I wish that was on the mirror. That's way cuter. That just, the other one is just too simple. Here we go. You guys always a lot. You see it first. Boom. I just lost the clear little thing that covers it, but cute. Okay, so she has like a pinky, a pinky peachy. These see, these are perfect. Pinky, it's like the perfect, especially to travel with the highlighters that you need because there's a pinky orange one. It's just like that T-shirt. Mm, that T-shirt. It's called Single Forever. Mm, that That's hitting home way too hard. That's about what I'm about to feel. I'm not giving up on love, but I'm searching for the one. And I want it so bad, but yeah. So here she is right here. It's not coming off, but it's very, um, very shimmery. And I should swatch these, but... I don't want to ruin it, okay, people? 
and we're not there we're not that kind of channel i probably should have swatched everything but you can you can see enough the next one is a perfect pink murderous fun love that the middle one and i'll uh, honestly i'm obsessed with that um the pink that's inside of his pink religion collection i did get that one and that i wear like as a blush and i'm obsessed with it i'm obsessed with it she looks way more subtle maybe we'll wear them together but i love a pink highlighter because i feel like it's fun for like a blush and the last one is pretty crazy that it's like a brown burgundy wine shimmer highlight it's called frosty heart <gasps> cute that's probably because he he probably likes frosties from Wendy's. Let's be honest. He loves fast food and he loves um, sweets and chocolate. Cute. Frosty heart. That's fun. I feel like I wear, might wear it more like an eyeshadow or maybe more like a fall highlighter maybe. Or like a lip topper. Or maybe even a fun eyebrow. I think that would be really hard to wear on the cheek. Maybe try it as a um, contour color, maybe. I don't know. I've never tried a highlight. I don't know if it's probably a bad idea to do a shimmer highlight highlighter color for bronzer, but or contour with worth a shot. Maybe it's for our darker sisters. So even then, that would be like their skin tone. I don't know. It's fun though. Like, sadly, I don't want to say, but the like the cavity palette and like. I don't really do it for me. The cavity highlighter palette. But that's fun. That's especially the pink and the the peach. That they're very wearable. I love having a peachy orangey with that vibe with my blushes and same with the pinky reddish. I need my pink highlighter to go with it. Cute. That's cute. Oh, it's magnetized. Cute. It's very it's that like cardboard palette version yeah cute love that love that it's much cuter than that heart sorry jeffrey baby even the way it's like cut out right here see how it's i don't know if you can tell but she just like i don't know the way it's cut out is even weird i don't know i feel like the colors are there i don't know i just feel like she missed the mark moment of silence gathering my thoughts um possibly taking a thumbnail i don't know i have no idea what i'm doing i just i watch so many youtube videos that's what they all youtubers say but all in all that was fun i'm a little disappointed but it's okay it was still fun it's a little buyer's remorse it was, it was like very expensive but you know what i think that's the perfect one for me probably i think that's probably i think the items that i got were the were very my vibe compared to like the other maybe other mystery boxes he's had but yeah i mean the point of a mystery box let's be honest is to get rid of that overstock of items that maybe had too many or couldn't sell or i don't know they're all very popular good items good good items so because remember at the beginning there was like this a lot of weird like green lipsticks and stuff that people just couldn't use or had a hard time using because there were harder shades to work with so i think he's learning like i said i wish there was more pinks and reds and more valentine tiny colors but i mean obviously nudes can also be there's some pinky nudes is kind of fun it's almost kind of like a starter kit if you never had jeffrey it's kind of awesome that's like a starter kit it's like every it's like one of almost every product he has it's like i will say i there's a lot of items a lot of items 
I should count. Just offhand, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Around 18 items. I might have missed one or counted something twice. I don't know, but around 18 items. That's pretty awesome. $180. So, yeah. That makes sense. Those palettes are expensive. The mirror is full price. So, it's fun that... It's fun to have things that are exclusive. I think the exclusive items for Valentine's will never come back again with that heart mirror... The palette, the highlighter palette, heartbreaker, the t-shirt, that's, oh, 19 items that I forgot, the t-shirt, I think, cute, super cute, I love the color and the theme, but like I said, I love hearts and love and all that stuff, so I love that, and then that cutthroat love, that's fun, because you know, I guess I should have known better, that that would be his take on love, it's heartbroken, and Cuckoo on love, like obviously he's been through it, so I get that. I feel the same, I suppose. But it would have been fun to have a pink, or well, he did a red, I guess. So, yeah, that's fun. That's cool. Wait, this video is way too long. 41 minutes. I'm gonna have to edit. That's way too long. I don't know. I would watch the whole thing, but maybe people wouldn't. I don't know. People, I feel like, love to have everything like 15 minutes or shorter. Mm, we'll see. Anyways, thanks so much for coming to my channel. This is like my first, like, really official video. I have like performance videos and singing videos and just like little things here and there. But I'm learning. I thought it'd be fun. Who knows? I thought it'd be fun to start a channel. See if anyone's interested in watching. I love watching videos like this. She's a little tired. She's kind of probably a little boring. But. <laughs> like I said she was working today. But I had to open this palette. And I wanted to make a record of it. Because. She's exclusive. Hey so yeah, thanks for coming to my channel. I hope you enjoyed it. Leave some comments. How can I improve? Be nice. <laughs> Please. Be constructive. I'll take ideas, obviously. Hopefully I can make some more. Tell me what things you'd like. Hopefully I can make some like get ready with me makeup videos. Like I love doing makeup and hair and I love that kind of stuff. So hopefully I can do some of that on this channel. But thank you so much for coming back to my channel. Just kidding. It's a little homage to Miss Jeffrey. You know she loves that. Anyways. Bye guys. Thanks for coming. I'll have to work on an outro. Something cute. Something me. Something glam. Something glam star. Something just me. If you have any ideas let me know. Like I said, my name for this channel will be Ashley Glam Star. That is my first single name, Miss Ashley. Thanks for coming. Hope you enjoyed. And see you next time. Bye.